Hey, welcome back for Trick Tip Tuesday. In today's tip, I'm going to talk about uh, bandsaw blade selection and uh, the options that we have available. So, um, you know, when you're selecting a bandsaw blade, obviously uh, the length of the blade is going to be determined on, on your machine. So we have all of the different sizes available uh, for all the different machines that we sell, uh, but we also have custom order options available as well uh, if you have a machine that's got um, a different size than what we have listed on our website. So I'll talk about that more in a second, but uh, when you go to select uh, tooth count on your bandsaw blades, uh, we have a chart that's easily accessible on our website that gives you uh, some basic parameters uh, to select the right tooth count based on the material you're cutting, whether it's round, pipe, tubing, uh, different structural materials uh, to round and rectangle uh, solids. It's going to give you a baseline of the tooth count that you need to be able to cut that material properly uh, over and over. So, you know, if you're cutting a different a wide range of materials, uh, thinner to thicker materials, that sort of thing, uh, it may be proper to change out the bandsaw blade in between cuttings to be able to um, prolong the life of your blades and to get the most uh, and most efficient cut um, as well. So. Um, on that chart, we also have a little uh, instruction on here on how to properly break in your bandsaw blades to help them last longer and really uh, get every dollar's worth out of them. So uh, from there, uh, we can custom order blade options down to quarter inch thick as far as the width, all the way up to two inches, and then from five feet long overall length uh, all the way up to about 22 feet in overall length and then a variety of different tooth counts within there. So if you have a custom option that you're needing, to fit your saw or to fit a custom uh, cutting application that you're trying to achieve, uh, give us a call and we can help you decide what's right for you based on the material you're cutting and the job and the, the machine that you have. So, um, and then most manufacturers of like say vertical band saws will have um, recommendations on the, the amount of radius you can cut, let's say in a flat plate, um, based on the width of the blade, whether it's a small quarter inch blade or a wider one inch blade, it'll tell you the, the radius you need on that. So uh, you'll have to take that into account as well. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions on the selection of your bandsaw blade, need any tips or pointers and want to make sure you get the right blade for your saw, for your cutting application, give us a call or visit our website at tricktools.com and uh, we'll help you out. So stay tuned for next Trick Tip Tuesday and we'll see you then.